Ranger second class, Pulaski. Sorry, Pulaski. Is that why they said don't mention Alaska? They don't want anyone talking about Pulaski? Yo, you played yourself. Oh, my health was low. I didn't even really notice. My bad. Alright friends, welcome back to another episode of our Control Let's Play. Uh, in the previous episode, we found our way into this Federal Bureau of... Uh, control? Yeah, Control. Uh, so, I heard, heard someone get shot, went in there, took the gun, and uh, hallucinated this uh, training area. Had a pretty hard tutorial. I almost died uh, to falling. And uh, yeah, that, that just would have been a bad time all around. So. We survived, and now all of a sudden there's zombies everywhere, and uh, some sort of weird chanting. I think of it. Never tried doing that. Kind of quieted them down. Come to think of it. What happens if I shoot them all? I really need to start stop pressing R. It's a habit. Yeah, I think the bullet just kind of pulls a little to the lower left. Don't worry, buddy, I got you. Be free. Ah, yes, peace and quiet. Eat. Be free. Thank you. Oh, did they drop health? Those little blue things are health. Damn! Calm down! Don't knock the furniture over, please! Alright, let's 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 just get on with it. If you're as confused as I am also, make sure you dab on that like, eat that subscribe button, and turn notifications on while we figure this all out. tried to evade me earlier. Burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. Is it though? It's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. Doesn't really sound like hissing though. I'm not sure they got that definition right. I'm glad we can make the chanting stop though. It was getting a little, uh, Making me a little uncomfortable. Uh, Federal Bureau of Control, how to handle unscheduled visitors entering the lobby. Start with the following. Welcome to the Federal Bureau of Control, established in 1964 as part of an effort to strengthen the government relations. We are proud to serve the United States and her people as we strive for transparency and excellence in all aspects of our esteemed nation's infrastructure. If you do not, if they do not leave, then ask them some questions. Are you here to see someone? Are you from New York City or just visiting? How did you find this place? If their answers are sufficiently harmless, explain that this is a secure federal office and that they'll need to leave. If their answers seem redacted, escort them to a private room. There, perform the gunner's psychological assessment. If their re the responses are within the acceptable range of deviance, see the provided scoring sheet, then redacted immediately. Remember, there's no such thing as too suspicious. Wow. So the goal is bore them until they leave, and if they don't, then leave after being bored. Uh, redacted them. Alright, alright. Examination of paranatural topics, urban legends. Summary, urban legends are believed to affect the creation of altered materials, but can also dictate the characteristics of an altered world event. And ah, urban legends are understood as the modern evolution of Jung's archetypes. Jung's ar archetypes? I'm, I'm gonna assume Jung. Uh, we recognize certain redacted, informed by our own redacted, and popularized by our media. We have additionally proven that urban legends can even be artificially redacted in popular culture using redacted, our bureau-made anthology television program. Once the seeds are sown, human imagination exacerbates the details. Certain paranatural phenomena contain clear elements of popularized folklore, Oz, that only occur on redacted. A pair of scissors that consume human redacted through two punctures on the redacted. These details living in the minds of so many have been given strength through belief. 
Uh, urban legends are not just stories for children. They are paranatural realities waiting to happen. Refer to file 4936942. Heh <laughs> nice. Uh, for full report. Interesting. So that, that pretty clearly establishes what's going on here. But I ain't never heard no urban legend about no hiss. No hiss and stuff. No, no siree. You hear that? Nothing about you. Whoa, whoa, uh, DMCA, please, no. No! Uh. I can't see him. Oh, they got grenades. Please, that radar. There we go. We got there. We got there. This is very red. Ooh, what's this? Ranger second class, Pulaski. Sorry, Pulaski. Is that why they said don't mention Alaska? They don't want anyone talking about Pulaski? Yo, you played yourself. Oh, my health was low. I didn't even really notice. My bad. New shift to sprint to quickly reposition in combat and make it harder for enemies to maintain accuracy. So they get more accuracy the longer you stand still. Good to know. And we're way the hell back here. Fuck. Everything's alive again. Sound that tried to invade me earlier. Oh my. Yes. Burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? Alright, it's our enemy. Got his ass. Please, no. I'm sorry. Woohoo! Sir, you be flanking pretty darn hard. We missed. I'm sorry. So is this, is this like the dude himself or like some uh, vulgar approximation? Undefined reading, hidden trend. Weapon mods. Shatter recoil efficiency, minus 5%. Recoil. Alright, we'll, we won't worry about breaking stuff down yet. Yep, spreading. Cleanse the control point. I'm down. What does that mean? Help me fix it. Uh. That'll do. I mean, this is. I like this room a lot better like this. Can you hear me? No. Are you with us? No. With the bureau. Hey, if I'm if I'm if I'm not against you, I'm for you. Okay. Where you at? All right, I'll bite. What's up, homie? I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. Uh, don't assume. I'm Pope Emily Pope, Doctor Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Yes. No. Jesse Faden. <laughs> I'm just visiting. I should. Yo, you saw what they do to visitors. Shit. You're the new director. Hold on. We're coming out. Well, too late now. Right, you got that gun and you're hiding in here. Come on. Director, Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. 
Hi, Somehow, Emily. This hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. Nice. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. Edgy. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Okay. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. It's okay, my mom says I'm special too. It's fine. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. Uh, I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. So about that same thing. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. Meanwhile, there's that dude. The whole room should... Chilling. He's vibing. We're good. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I walked in, dude. There was no security guards. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... I can't even. Look, Jessica, uh -huh. I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. I kind of shot them. that's possible... Our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the bureau she's a part of. Close yes. enough. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. Thank you, thank you. Okay. You with me? No, we gotta loot first. Before. Push the hiss out. Let me take the classified document. Thank you. Field research uh, on oh. No, we already we already read that. Uh Examination of paranatural topics. Control points. Summary control points are locations that the Bureau has identified as being vital junctions of the oldest house. When the appropriate harmonization devices are arranged around the control point in the redacted arrangement, the surrounding area will not experience any unforeseen building shifts. These control points are discovered by redacted detection of an unobstructed ping using the, dis the redacted within a 37-foot radius. Numerous researchers have attempted to define control points, calling them nerve junctures or redacted or vulnerable spots of the oldest house. The common factor in these theories is that control points are susceptible to external influence, which allows us to stabilize the oldest house and work more confidently inside it. Theoretically, this technology could be extrapolated to stabilize the oldest house as a whole, but testing has found that certain parts of the building were refused to be redacted. I would, refer, re I would refuse to be redacted too if I could help it. Refer to file 7252788 for a full report. Thank you, thank you. Alright. That was informative. Emergency supply storage. Give me the nummies, dude. Give me the nummies. Yo, can we get... Oh, that's locked. I'm sure we'll get there. What's up, buddy? Uh, that was not good for the head. Even if they were healthy. Sorry about your friend. It didn't work. The hiss has burrowed too deep. Uh, hiss agent. The hiss manifests in human hosts in numerous ways. The most common and least intense form is seen in the many corrupted agents floating throughout the bureau. The hiss agents have maintained their human appearance, undergoing no obvious physical transformation. The most notable distinction from an unaffected human is the fact that they levitate. That's a pretty good difference. 
These hiss have displayed no aggressive behavior. They only seem interested in vocalizing the strange incantation ad infinitum. Perhaps these vessels are only meant to propagate the hiss corruption, like spores or Wi-Fi boosters, or are they cocoons preparing to enter their next stage of evolution? When attacked, hiss agents disappear, perhaps entering a state of invisibility or undergoing a transformation into a purely resonant form. Research is ongoing. Refer to file redacted for report. Find them. Be that way. Redact all the fun stuff. So that was like a fast travel point. Hey, I got health back. We need to make a plan, Jesse. I need to make sure there's nothing confidential around here. This, this is important. I believe this is where... Oh, no, that's the DMCA box. Still locked. What do we have here, Will? Avoid modern technology. I'll do my best, but something tells me it's not going to work out very well. Can't read any of that. If something pops out of the dark here, I'm going to be upset. Is this, uh, is this thing, uh, this jukebox an SCP? I mean, uh, aww. I think it might be. There was nothing here. Whoop whoop. See? What? Oh. Sector elevator. I thought that said secret elevator. I was about, I was, I was very confused. I'll admit. I can't cleanse them. I saw. I watched you evaporate, my friend. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll That's fair. It. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an... incident in my hometown, Ordinary. It's a good name. Years ago. Descriptive. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones. I was gonna say, if she knows it offhand. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. Oh, well, better. I'm but the director. Boss, Casper Darling, Motherfucker. Know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. Ah, yes. I think they're what saved us. A few of Is us. Is that what you're wearing? And Director Trench would know. Trench. I can the ask him. Ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone. Oh. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Wait, I gotta deal with the board? I didn't sign up for this. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mail room. Uh, of it's course. part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. You hate to see it. They call me the director. They call me Mr. Okay. Director. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. 
I didn't imagine this. Was this a cerebro? Be part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. Wait, she's so enthused about being a part of this? I thought she hated it all. At least that chair looks comfy. Get me the president. Look, I know this is all new to you, so don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. How do you unredact the something? The comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. I kind of wish that was a question I could actually ask. Uh, health recovery per element per, uh, pick up 20%. That's fun. Missions enter the communications department to find the hotline. I can do that. Portrait. Another portrait of Trench. What the fuck, man? How many pictures of him do we need? Follow the signs to the mail room. You can get to the hotline containment chamber through there. The hotline should be in the communications department. Yeah, you said that. I just wanted to know. This is a lot. This is a lot of options. Do we do we want to commit? We've already read everything. Where did the hiss come from? We're I'm learning. Sure. You said the hiss was here when you entered. Did you see anything like that outside before you came in? No. No, just inside. The source is internal then. See, the old that source that is out. a sprawling complex with openings to other places as well. I don't even know where to start looking. But in the context, it's good news. The lockdown holds. The hiss escaping the building would be the end. The end. world out there if you ask me, but I wouldn't want the hiss to destroy it. I'm with you on that, Emily. Yeah, that's, that's just good on principle. You mentioned the oldest house. What is it? This building, the bureau headquarters, the oldest house, is a shifting place. You've seen it. It transcends its physical limits. I've been to New York a few times. How didn't I notice this place? It's an attribute of the building. This is a place of power. The oldest house doesn't like attention. So unless you're purposely trying to find it, you don't. I see. It's perfect for us. The work we do here is essential, but unstable. The Bureau prefers not to be noticed. And we need strong walls to make sure nothing gets out. So without you, I never would have found the front door. Okay. You're welcome. I'm gonna assume that when uh, she talks to the gun or whatever, she's talking to us. This trench guy. I keep hearing him in my head. Is he a ghost? Are his feet Talk okay? I doubt we're talking about a Your ghost trench foot's in the traditional bad. sense. But an echo, maybe. See, if he was killed by the service weapon, your gun, maybe it's his final thoughts recorded by the bullet in his brain, like a, a deep space probe sending back data. Whoa. But that's just a hypothesis on my that's part. That's need the gun to research it. <laughs> I don't know if you want to test that one yourself. Given the circumstances. I think I will. Yeah. Yo, come to think of it, weren't we, weren't we here for a janitor job? I feel kind of bad. Uh, bailing on Ati like that. Can you tell me what an object of power is exactly? This is all, well, new to me. <laughs> Don't worry, I love going over the basics. So objects of power are mundane objects that house paranatural energies and have developed a link to the astral plane and can thus be controlled, which is what differentiates them from altered items, which are still housings of paranatural forces, but are more volatile and cannot be bound in the peri-utilitarian sense. I'm gonna need you to slow down on that word. Did she memorize this? She spoke that Got shit it. like it's her job. Thanks. I didn't catch any so, of that. So HRA stop you from becoming hiss. It seems that way. I mean, I hadn't even heard of an HRA mm. until a few weeks ago when Dr. Darling started handing them out. Well, I began analyzing mine as soon as I could. Of course, and of course. I did too. A powerful short range frequency way beyond anything I've ever seen. Doesn't the timing seem suspicious? I thought that too. Dr. Darling usually likes to unveil his latest breakthrough in big presentations. With these, he just passed them out. 
His behavior makes me wonder what exactly he knew. And where is he? Well, that was informative. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. Just let me know. Uh... So I still still don't really know what the hell is going on, but I feel like I have context right now. Undefined reading, not gonna worry about that. Some generic material of some kind. That's all that matters. Uh, I think I did not go... There was one side that I did not go to. That was uh, where we came from. The stuff we did not get. And there's actually actually stuff to be gotten here. Hell yeah. Yeet. Yo, I hate math. All my homies hate math. Director's office. Yo, I am the director. Let me in. Oh, thank you. Uh, welcome to the oldest house. Uh, hello, as you all should know by now, the R4 reports are due by the end of the week. We're still waiting on them from a number of people. If you need an extension, please request form R4.E from your supervisor. If you think you're exempt from filing an R4, then you'll need to get written permission from your department chief saying so. Remember, R4s are mandatory under section 75.2 of the employee manual. If your R4 requires interdepartmental claims, then please contact the appropriate department head, Dr. Darling, Miss Marshall, Mr. Salvador or Mr. Kirkland, as needed. They'll be busy on Thursday in their annual policy review, so please schedule accordingly. Best, your admin team. Not my admin team. I didn't elect them. Oop. Yeet. <laughs> so we, I understand the gun powers, but where did we get the hand powers? Because we were able to punch stuff uh, earlier. I seem to have forgotten the hotkey, but we, we had an impressive punch with a, a nice little blast on it. So I'd like to know where that came from. Examination of paranatural topics, technological limitations of the oldest house. The oldest house imposes certain limitations on our bureau, but... By far the most restrictive is the inability to use certain technological instruments. The oldest house does not allow devices that receive or emit any redacted signal. Radio waves are the only transmittable signals in the oldest house, and even those are often re unreliable. If the power of collective unconscious is taken into account, it could be that certain pieces of technology are too new in the cultural redacted for the oldest house to redact them. Similarly, these items have not been known to become recept receptacles for altered status. Technology may be moving at too fast a pace for the redacted to occur. Modern technology tends to disappear and break here, sometimes quite violently. Redacted agents have been injured by cell phones exploding in their pockets while entering the old house. Refer to file 419-1935 for full report. Alrighty then. That's why we saw the poster, Avoid Modern Technology. Okay. Yo, nope, not touching that one. Can't fool me. Not twice. Yo, the, the stuff is talking. I don't know what it's saying, though. Shifted bathroom complaint. Listen, I know you can't control building shifts, but the executive level restroom has been missing for weeks now. I worked my ass off in, in the Islamabad station for three years. I've earned the right to a nice workplace shitter. If you can't bring it back, at least find out where it went. D. Rodriguez. Alright, alright. I can, uh... I can understand his, uh, chagrin. Though, if, if the building did the thing, then why is it someone else's problem, you know? Energy gain from headshots, 15%. Not gonna worry about that. I like headshot damage. Well? Thought I saw something interactable. Oh. 
I'm really glad we uh, got to read about that dude's shitter. I, I feel honored. I knew there was more. I feel like I'm gonna need these energy boost. Uh, just six percent energy. That doesn't sound exciting enough to counter healing. Did I already come through here and I just missed that last time? I don't know. Enter the communi communications department to find the hotline. Get that auto save going. Yeet. You good, buddy? You good? Do I have any outfits? I don't. Damn. Off to the secret elevator. Just kidding, it's not open. Wait. It's me, I'm the director. Nice. So now I'll start finding pictures of me all over the place. Hell yeah. I'm down for that. All right, this time, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait for it, wait for it, for sure, yeet. Uh, maybe, maybe it's this way. Yo, I gotta go apologize to Ati. Executive Affairs, Central Executive, where did she say to go? Toggle map there. Oh my, okay. She did say it was through the executive office. Yeah, we're going the exact wrong way. Oh, director's office. I didn't realize there was a door there last time. We got the, the phone over. We're here. Wait, didn't she say they'd have the door open? I am, as they say, confused. Fine then. Is it this way? Ah, yes, yes, it is. There it is again. A welcome message. Enough of that. I tried to reload again. Alright. I feel like we're gonna actually start running into, like, stuff happening through that door, and uh, we've already been on this video for about half an hour now. So I know it hasn't been the most action-packed video, but we're, we're getting that sweet, sweet context. Did he just say we wait in the stains? We're gonna we're gonna walk over here so we don't get distracted or redacted. Uh, yeah, not not the most uh, combat filled episode, but I'm I'm sure we'll get to it uh, in due time. For now, I think the context we're getting is useful, so I'm okay with it. But I, I hope you enjoyed and uh, learned a lot with me. And if you did, make sure you dab on that like, yeet that subscribe button, turn notifications on, and come see me in the next one. Yeet.